Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I'm here with my December favorites and yes I did, uh, I have done some favorite videos for 2019 but I also wanted to do a December favorites because some of the favorites I have each month isn't like my super favorite of the year. If you are, if you are doing makeup things, makeup you know that you can switch favorites and one you can have for favorite for a month and then the next one, yeah, it goes in periods. So I have some things that I have really loved during December, so I am going to show, show you what I have used. And we can start with a thing, this like <laughs> bugs me a little bit. This is a product that I have had for a long time, I haven't used it the whole year, but pretty much this year. And that is the Smashbox sm 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 Photo Finish Primer Water. And I think it's okay as a primer, but I have used this now in December as a setting spray. And oh my god, this is so good. It gives an amazing glow and it felt like my makeup really stayed on. So I have used this as a setting spray sometimes and oh my god. Why haven't I noticed it? I have gone through a little bit more or maybe it's half of the bottle and now I notice that it's amazing as a setting spray. So I have used it as a primer, done my makeup and then use it, using it as a setting spray. And it says set, ref set and refresh spray. So, so yeah, I think I'm going to start to use this for both primer and setting spray from now on. So this I have really been loving now during December. I love it more as a setting spray than primer. Another base product that I have found again in my collection is the Moonshild Glow Kit from Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is my favorite moon kit. <laughs> my favorite glow kit. I have the Aurora as well. But this... I really love it. I almost only use like these shades so like a clover, pink heart and blue eyes. I use pink heart the most, but this is so, so good. I don't think this is available anymore and I don't know why Anastasia don't want to keep this because this is amazing. And I have also used this purple horse shoe as an inner corner, not today, but another day and amazing. So this has been my favorite highlighter for December. And then I have some ice product, ice products, eye products to talk about. And one product is for my brows and that is Colourpop Precision Brow Pencil. I had this as a favorite, I don't know, but in the beginning of this year. But now I love it for another reason. I usually use this to fill in my brows and I really liked it. But then I was like, it feels like they are too like sharp edges and I don't really like that when I'm going to work then I like more like this maybe they're pretty sharp now as well but it's easier to do them more natural with a shadow than a pencil but now in December I've started to do my makeup after film after work more and then I usually have my eyebrows on but they have faded a little bit during the work day nothing strange about that so i have just filled them in with this like to make them a little bit fuller and really love that so i am going to use this for that reason <laughs> so that feels good that i like i don't know how much is left of this but i want to use it up to f fix my brows a little bit before i start filming so yeah really like this so now with another purpose purpose so okay a pen that I really have loved this month is Teaspoon from Colourpop and this has been like the pen that I always wanted to buy from Colourpop because a lot of people talk about Teaspoon and I bought like this kit in April I think it was and then Teaspoon was one of them and so I have really really liked Teaspoon and I think I have a green from Linda Holberg but sometimes I feels like that is too bright green but this is perfect the Linda Holberg is also perfect but they are not the same 
So this teaspoon I really really like. The only thing is this is loose. You can I can still use it, but it's loose. <laughs> Color pop. Why do you do this? It's good for you that you are sheep. And my favorite palette of this month has been Ace Beauté Oceanic. I love this palette so much. I had it in my favorites of 2019. I'm pretty sure of. It looks like this. It has some of my absolute favorite shades ever. Like this one, this one, and this one. They are amazing. And also like this one is amazing. And a lot of these shades are amazing. And this blue one, blue clam, so good. It's such a good blue. So this has really been my favorite palette for this month. I want to play with this so, so much. And then to the last things, I have two lippies that I really loved. One that I think you maybe know which one it is. And another one, I don't think you have no idea. And one that I think you know which one it is, is from Kaleidos. It's one of their lip tonics. This is in Immersion. I love Kaleidos lip tonics and this shade... I love it so much. I have had this in pretty many videos. I have had this outside of YouTube and it stays on so good. It's like a stain when it... It stain your lips love it and this shade is amazing so this has been one of my favorite colors <laughs> my favorite lipstick this month and also this year so yeah Kaleidos lip tonic in immersion I wonder if it's pronounced like that I I hope it is and the other lip favorite that you don't know uh, you know that I have this if you follow me on Instagram but I don't know that you think that I like this because I haven't used it on YouTube. I have used it quite a lot outside of YouTube this month and it is a shine lip liquid from Body Shop and this is in Apple Taffy and I got this in the advent calendar from Body Shop and I really like this and one thing I love with Body Shop's lip shines the applicator it's like one of those little maybe like hearts I love this and the shade. I have had this when I don't have any makeup but my lips feels pretty dry. I've just painted this on and so so good. So this one I have really loved and maybe 2020. That sounds crazy to say. 2020. It's going to be my year when I fell in love with lip glosses i don't know maybe we will see so yeah that was all of my favorites for december of 2019 i really hope you liked this video and i am going to continue with this favorite videos next year as well because i i like to talk about things that i've loved a little bit more that month and you seem to like them so yeah I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!